Welcome back to the Tropical Update. It's Saturday, October 28th. I'm Tom, and I'll be guiding you through the graphics. We're going to be looking at that area of weather that's uh, starting to move north out of the Caribbean Sea, and it's going to be moving over uh, Cuba, and it's going to be bringing showers and storms to South Florida and also the Bahamas. Well, let's go ahead and pull up the tracking on it and uh, here is our spaghetti models and uh, you can see they're expecting it to sort of move northeast and it's going to be going over Cuba over the cave it's going to get near the Cayman Islands they'll be feeling it and uh, the Keys and South Florida and uh, the Bahamas so um, definitely and it's actually going to be uh, picking up speed here uh, in the next few hours now here's the cone on it, and uh, pretty much uh, the same as what we're seeing with the models. Uh, they expect it to be a storm, tropical storm, at any time. And uh, I wouldn't be surprised at the 5 a.m. advisory it uh, becomes named, uh, or maybe the intermediate one uh, a little later on. But uh, definitely it is uh, it is building and... Um, uh, should be getting a name now here is our intensity model and um, you can see that they are showing that it possibly could even get to be a very strong uh, tropical storm but that's uh, a good oh 24 30 hours out and um, by that time it'll be uh, probably closer to the Bahamas if not further out this thing like I said is going to speed up here real quick and uh, here is a picture of it and this is the enhanced one and uh, it's hard to make out the land masses there but um, it's uh, near Belize and uh, Cancun area and it is moving uh, north northeast and you can just barely see Cuba there uh, let's look at our other one here. This is a little bit better. Yeah, this one shows a little better. You can see Cuba up at the top, and uh, you can see the Cayman Island, which is uh, in the middle of Cuba, but south. Uh, Jamaica's there. They've been getting a lot of rain. But uh, like I said, it's going to be picking up speed here real soon and uh, moving to the northeast. So... Um, they will be getting rain and stuff in Florida on Saturday. And will they get wind? Well, uh, looking at the forecast for Miami, they're not showing any really strong winds. Uh, they probably could get in that 25 gusting to 30, uh, but no, uh, no heavy winds. It's going to be more of a rain event. And let's pull up our thing for rain. Uh, they're expecting somewhere in the area of two to four inches of rain, uh, especially along uh, South Florida, the coast there, and in the Keys. Some places in the Keys could get uh, four, four to six inches. Um, again, it's moving pretty quick, so uh, it's not going to uh, have that same total of um, rainfall as they were getting in Central America. Uh, the next thing we're going to pull up, this is our uh, water temperatures. And um, where it's at right now is in that, oh, 84 to 85 degree area, which is uh, just about perfect for development. And then as it moves over Cuba, it'll come into some cooler waters. Uh, but then once it gets past the uh, Bahamas, uh, it's going to get back out there. Uh, into some of the warmer waters and they expect it to intensify some after that. Now here's the uh, another run of in spaghetti models and you can see that these are actually showing it curving back in uh, well up there near Maine. So we'll have to watch that. That's a lot of days out and we know that that can be off by as much as 200 miles. But uh, definitely where it's tight at the bottom uh, it's going to be real close to South Florida. Now here's our map. Uh, you can see there's that cold front that's uh, moving through Tennessee 
and that'll be going into North Carolina tomorrow. Uh, you can see where they've got uh, the storm already uh, over Cuba. So it's going to be moving a pretty good bit in the next uh, six, six to 12 hours. And uh, also, um, it'll be interacting with that front that is uh, moving down. So uh, we'll just have to keep a good eye on it. But definitely South Florida is going to be getting a lot of rain out of this. Well, thank you for tuning in. Uh, hit the subscribe button if you haven't. Um, we'll keep an eye on the new models that are going to come out here after uh, oh a few hours and see if anything has changed. But uh, looks like a lot of rain for South Florida and over Cuba. So have a great Saturday and we'll talk to you soon.